Kansas City woman forged her own path to earn her seat at the male-dominated executive table in banking. It's our final day for our month-long series for Women's History Month, and we're focusing on women in banking. 41 Action News anchor Cynthia Newsom tells us how Liberty Bank's top female executive had a long and challenging road to get to the top. Um, from that standpoint, uh, home, home ownership is the first step. A candid conversation with a customer needing a big loan to build housing for low-income families. I'm excited. I come to work extremely passionate. Tanika Brockman is in her element. Were you uh, or the church providing any type of creative down payment assistance program? She knows exactly what to ask and how to help. She's the regional vice president of Liberty Bank, the highest ranking female executive in Liberty Bank's Kansas and Missouri regions. She's living what she calls her purpose at Kansas City's only black owned bank. I decided that I wanted to come to Liberty Bank last March at the height of the um, Black Lives Matter movement. Um, from a personal standpoint, it became very disheartening as I moved up into the ranks of banking and supported a higher or more affluent clientele that there was no minority in my book of business. I wanted to be able to help more people of color move up into that affluent um, um, or private banking or wealth management um, arena. Her desire to help stems from her personal challenges and she's not shy about sharing. In college, I was an English major. I wanted to be a lawyer. And I got pregnant at 19 and my grandmother said, you better learn about money real quick and you better figure it out. And literally I changed my major to finance. Her first job in banking was at a call center. It wasn't enough to pay the bills. Wanting to understand and get to a better place myself financially for my, my son and ultimately my children, that drove me to say, how do I start being strategic around charting a career path in this industry? She got her undergraduate degree in business and finance and her master's in business and still struggled to get customers. How can I show you that I can help you with your money being a minority um, woman and also young to eliminate the, the, the race barrier? I added value. And what that looks like is when you're coming in to get anything banking, um, I provided a team for you. She provided tax strategists, accountants, and attorneys. Her clients loved it and loved her, and that's how her career skyrocketed to the top. Now she's mentoring other women in banking. In our industry, there's a huge ambition gap because we're so underrepresented. We don't even think about, oh my gosh, I really could do this. And not just I can do it, I need to do it. I need to move up. Tanika is living the dream, enjoying success. She's married with five children, but she's still increasing her value, working on her doctorate in business and organizational leadership, and focused on making a difference for her clients and the Kansas City community. Cynthia Newsom, 41 Action News.